Hello, hello and big welcome. Uh, it's Monica from Mona Lisa Crafts. Welcome to my channel. Uh, first, Happy New Year 2024. Um, it's the 1st of January when I'm recording this video. So I wish you all the best for the new year and lots of lots of lovely crafty time spent with your favourite crafts. Uh, so let's move on. Today I'm coming with a little bit of shopping haul. Um, I did on eBay and I've got a little bit from works. So maybe let's start. Let's start um, with shopping from um, works. So what I found, sorry for the noise. So I bought two boxes of, they are wooden wrapping toppers for the presents, but for me, they scream at toppers for a Christmas card. Nice and simple with the craft paper, maybe a little bit of white, a star wishes, a few splats or um, anything you fancy and card is ready. So I bought two boxes, they were two pounds, but they were on the sale for one pound each. So that's really cheap. You've got 10 in the pack. So you can make 10 cards. Um, and I thought that will be really nice way of making cards. So I'm hoping maybe in next few days I will try to make one or two just to show you a few of my ideas how I would use these. So I've got two boxes. Let me just put them away. And another thing, sorry, I just wrote the box yesterday when I was sorting my room. This got me really excited. So, obviously, it's a wax seal, stamps and wax seal. Now, they were on, in the shop before Christmas, they were £4. Still very cheap when you think you've got a handle and you've got two stamps. Now, one is really beautiful snowflake. Doesn't have to be for Christmas, can be for winter. So I think this is really great. And one is Merry Christmas. Another, I can't wait when, another things I would like to try. I've got a few of them um, and I would like to start using them more this year. So that's my um, hope. <laughs> so let's see if I can come out with the card, maybe with the snowflakes to show you. So they were four pounds. But the, again, they were on the sale. So if you live in UK, if you've got the shop works, really worth it because I bought them for £2. Normally you need to pay a few quid for one of the stamps. And here you've got two plus, um, obviously, a handle. And you've got like a golden, shiny work seal and red. So I think it's a bargain. It's definitely a bargain. I'm very excited about it and I would like I I'm hoping I'm going to be using it soon. So that's from the works. Another haul is on eBay. Now I have been looking at sweet poppy stencils for a while and I have been looking what people making uh, with them. And I think they're very cool, very versatile. You can use them with the stamping, with the pastes. Uh, and I'm hoping that this year, this is my year for stencils. I've got lots of stencils and I would like to use them more in my card making and paper crafting. So I thought this is so cute. We have, sorry for reflection. So we've got two elephants, beautiful here. You can use for a um, and your baby, for good luck, for anything really uh, you like. Because I think it's really cute. So that's the first stencil. And uh, then I have two more stencils. And what is great about it, they've got also a die cut. So here, sorry, let me see if I can open that. So I came across a lady who was doing some lovely stenciling see if you can see i think it's just gorgeous you can use that way you can use this way 
I mean, it is amazing. So what she was doing, she was using oxide. She was putting some oxide and then stamping in it. And it's nice, quick card, especially if you... Um, now, postage goes really, um, got really expensive. And if you're sending cards abroad like me, um, then you know the card will be flat. Then you know there will be no problem with the postage. And I think it's so cool. So you've got a die, so you can do your stencil, then cut out and stick on the paper, or you can do directly on the card. And I think it's so beautiful. And it's just gorgeous. Look on those snowflakes. Everything is a, such a good quality stencil. You know nothing is going to move. You know nothing is going to break. I haven't tested yet, but I'm already in love, so... Soon as I will test it, I'm sure you will see some video on my channel, me testing this and maybe making a card. So I'm very excited about that one because I think it's so beautiful. So that's the second one. Sorry, I'm just going to keep that together. And the last one, it, I wasn't really keen on it, but it was in the um. So they were all together as one bundle, and the most important I wanted to uh, that one. And obviously, I love those elephants. And here we've got um, a crackers. So I thought, why not? Why not? We can try. Sorry, let me just take it out so you can see better. So again, we've got a die that cuts them in two pieces. Because they are two. So this is the die. Still cute. I mean, you can use those lovely. Uh, if you don't want to use the cracker, you can use the stars but i think it's still very lovely if you use christmas crackers nice nice quick card again and great that you've got dice so you can cut out so yes i am very excited about this but the most one is that one i think it's just stunning so i hope i will find some little bit of time to play with it and come and show you what I've done. So that's one. And another bundle. Again, that was eBay. And that was Heartfelt Creation. I just... I am just excited about it, really. Because, first, it doesn't have to be nothing to do with Christmas. could be winter. But, so what I have... I've got two stamps of snowmans. And what, what is great about it, in the set, they obviously two dies to cut those snow, uh, snowmen and a three dies of trees, snow key spruce. So here I will show you. And they are also two beautiful. Oh, we've got extra one. I didn't know about that one. So this is what, one is like a Christmas slate. Going on the sledge. Is that not sledge? Sledge. <laughs> and we've got two lovely snowflakes and trees. Now I'm really excited about those trees because you can use them all year round uh, in your stamping. So that's another one. It's kind of from one collection, I think. When I looked, what collection was that? Hmm. I'm not sure. Snow kissed. Um, oh, snow kissed. I think collection or something like that. Um, so we've got that. Then we have got this beautiful big da uh, tag, and you can see again this. Nothing to do with Christmas. Nothing to do with winter, because they are just some swirls. So you can use them however you like. Again, very versatile. So I'm very excited about that. And more snowflakes. And what's right about them? They are so different. So sometimes you can use these stamps to make your own background. And I don't have many nice snowflakes. So I'm very excited about that one. So that's another one. And the last one is... You can see here, to be honest, I could show you the back, silly me. So you've got the snowflake um, 
but doesn't have to it doesn't look like a snowflake so we, we've got the outer die and inner die so you can use in and out however you like and they are those dies to cut those snowflakes and obviously we've got a tag so i mean again very very excited about it oh it shows you here i didn't even know we had that one so just i am oh sorry i am very very excited about those dies so here we go that shows you better so we've got this cute snowman's then you've got die cuts then you've got the trees two snowflakes a stamp of die snowflakes so they are such so gorgeous and so different as well and the last one is the dice so i as i said i'm, I'm looking forward to have a little play and use them in different ways doesn't have to be used for christmas or winter so i'm hoping i can use them for more occasions in my crafting so that's that and the last one oh yes there's quite a few things to be honest guys so i got a nice bundle from craft stash so that was my christmas present so first let me just put this away so first i bought textures by lou collins um sentiments because i thought you know what you always need some sentiments until you stamp them sometimes i just want nice quick a card when i just don't want to mess around and fluff about with the sentiments so you can cut them out so what's great about it she changed so for example you've got here you are so beautiful to me be happy hello sending love hi so there's some quotes there's some um, lovely sentiments black and white again you if you use the white ones you can use inks and just touch them with the ink and match them with your cardstock or your um card idea so i thought this is really nice and is what we've got here let's have a look so a4 paper pack uh one uh, 190 gsm 20 sheets four design times five so it's plenty as you can see it's really plenty to use and i'll have it for a while so I think that's really great. I'm, I'm really excited about that. Then I got myself again on eBay. This beautiful stencil. Really big. Is it... Let me just see. What the size? I would say is A4. I think it's A4. So we've got some scripts. We've got some lovely texture that you can use only part of the stencil you don't have to use all but great thing is if you do dl a size card you've got enough to use it all across so this is from imagination craft and it says mixed media art stencil so that's that's the stencil and um, next thing, I bought another uh, Distress Oxide. Now, if you're watching me today, uh, I think there is a promotion. I bought a few more. So just, I think, on the 1st of January, you can buy inks uh, for, um, is it free for £15? So obviously, that's £5. Normally, they six ninety nine nearly seven pounds so it's really good so this one is the lost shadow i think it's one of the newest and i try on the kind of white cardstock i really like it it will be perfect for little little things so yeah 
so that's their distress oxide i can show you side sorry my light is not as great so it's kind of really really light grayish between white and grayish i would say so that's one and i think after christmas just after christmas or something like between christmas and they were doing every so often they're doing this promotion they're doing um how much did they pay it's one two three four five six set six sets and i think it it cost me around 50 pounds maybe less but when you think how much so it's less than a 10 pounds per set way less than a 10 pounds so what i bought i bought a dl size card so you can see you've got 11 dice here um and the measurements do they have measurements here they don't i think but it's quite big then i bought a slim line set as well so obviously if you compare they're a bit smaller i mean this, the the length is the same so that's slim line then nested hexagon dice uh, dice set and what's lovely they obviously have got those rounded corners so you don't I like them and again you've got 20 oh la, here we go largest die is 187 by 173 millimeters so it's really big die you can make a big cards out of them and i didn't have many big nesting dies so that's why i decided to go for them and also because they are a little bit different so this one is the next one really big die can make really nice big cards so 18 dice in this one and then we've got next ne uh, nested octagon die set i mean look at the size less than 10 pounds for all this that's really worth it and you can make your own card bases you can make bigger project what i was struggling with because i've got lots of nesting dice but they are quite small and these ones are just great and the last one squares dice set so if you if you see it's 199 millimeters so nearly 20 centimeters by 20 centimeters so that is a a big die so again very versatile you can use different ways so that was my christmas present to myself and because they were in such a great promotion um like i said i think it, it comes less than 10 pounds per set so that's that is very cheap in my opinion by a big size dice so that's the last last haul my last shopping from craft stash um if you're interested i'm going to add you the link for the craft stash uh, shop online if you want to have a look um they have different promotion every so often so if for example if you think you would like to buy some of this i will wait and see because every so often they do 50 percent off um or you know any extra die so just keep an eye whatever you need um to buy and i hope you will have a lovely day full of crafting and enjoy this lovely next adventure because we are new year 2024 so take care everybody thank you for watching and see you later Bye bye